Hello there everybody and welcome back to my let's play Spell Force 40 episode 55. Okay, do you know how I said um something to AI? And I looked at this last episode, it's like 38, nothing to do with AI. Well if you go to 37, what apparently came out Friday. So in other words, I played the, the episodes, uh then Friday happened, it got patched, and then I started doing my last two episodes and this one, and I was like, yeah, I just insane. Well, look at this. Uh, where is it? Single campaign changes. <clears throat> Enemy armies in campaign now behave more like the skirmish AI to offer a more challenging and fun experience. I remember the skirmish AI from the baby. I can't really done it in the main game yet. It constantly kept coming at you. You have to be super aggressive, and that's what they're doing now. This includes smart usage of units, and what they do, they're pulling away um, to pull me out and. Trying to pull me to their group like I'm trying to do to them, so that makes sense. Including uh, using catapults more simultaneously. I haven't seen a catapult used, but that could be later on in the game. More varied attacks and retreat patterns, especially in hard difficulties. Yeah, I'm noticing. Less reliance on resource advantage, allowing for more interesting dynamics. I don't understand what that means. Uh, RTS scenario has been reworked to better fit the UA style, the style of AI behavior. Some key cowards have been balanced, because the, the, the progression play difficult. So in other words, when I said, has AI been improved? Bloody hell it has. But what, what my thing is, because I'm loading up in the middle of a game, and the AI suddenly got super smart, apparently, am I so far gone in this particular map that the, 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 the AI tipping point is basically too much for me, basically, at this point? What sucks, because I don't really want to have to do this level again for the second time. Last time I had to do it again, didn't I? Because they died, I didn't even realise you, you had to defend them. Because I thought it was protected, so I assumed you took all this, and once you got down here, they would then walk across. Or when you went down there, you would, like, click on um, the, the head leader. Yeah, go now, go now. And then we would defend them, and obviously as long as you killed all these, they'd be fine. And then I found out they died, and... So that's kind of made me restart the game. This level. And then, obviously, I got to the last point where if I was halfway through this, similar to was last, uh, last time. And then, obviously, I, I stopped. I'm just going to carry on doing another hour what I'm doing now, next week. Then they patched it for that Friday, and apparently the AI's out of whack now. Or at least in the area where I am. Because, like, where was it? That changed along. The bit I didn't understand. RTS uh, scenario has been reworked to better fit new stuff. No, that one. Less reliant on resource advantages. So, to me, they're not reliant on... So, the sounds of it, they had a resource advantage before. So, so maybe, like, cheat, like, instantly, like, you know, how we start with zero and have to gather everything. They started off with 200. I don't know. I'm just pulling numbers out. But I'm assuming that's how it worked. And before they were very reliant on it, because they weren't gathering themselves, so to speak, they would kind of have units and they'll attack you every now and again, etc. etc. Now they're using what that other source they have, what's well, better. But again, in my scenario where I was trying to be very defensive, they probably pile this stuff up in my current loaded game, meaning they don't have to be reliant on it because I got like probably a couple of thousand as we are. So in other words, I have to be a lot more aggressive. What I don't think is possible where I currently am, without starting this again. So, do I have one before I enter this? That's my, that's my question. <sighs> do I actually have one? Obviously 14 is not far enough into it. Uh, so what was this? 13 or 3? This is 13, 13. So that's too far in. 12, 37, so that might be. Okay, let's, tr let's try and let's try what we have. So we have 12. Let's see what 12 is. Because that's kind of annoying. That I think I've basically screwed by the patch. The patch itself sounds like a good thing, but obviously you need to go into it expecting what? this. And if you're not... It's a similar thing that happens with Hegemony 3, uh, one of my original games. I was uh, keeping my guys... Um, oh, I think in debt. It's famous for their gold sure. wheat field. I was, I was keeping my guys in debt all the time. It's, it's on my Hegemony 3 one of my original games. And I was doing pretty well. And then they patched it. What that meant was, the changes is, when they're in debt, everyone starts leaving if you're not paying them. So in other words, well, I was in debt, but my people were starving. They were running, I think they were running low with like, hardly any food, so they had hardly any um, morale, I believe. And they were keeping me, they were keeping everyone away from me, barely, as I was trying to get my money back up. But then with a the new patch, with no money, you guys are dessert. So my all my army's just disbanded. Do you know within the space that episode I first did on, and my whole game was screwed. And I think that's basically what's happened with this but less extreme version, because obviously, as long as I have an early little save, I can technically go back. 
So, with that being said, where did this save load me up? Okay, this is definitely before I took this, so this is still too uh, too late. That was 12, so about 11. Um, I'll say 5 before I ask him, maybe. Ugh, this, this stuff to me sucks. I'm glad they've done it, but I just wish it wouldn't. Mm, your game when you're in the middle of it. Oh, come on, come on. It's famous for their golden wheat fields. Yes, you're famous. Okay, this is just when we started, haven't we? Need scouting? Of course. Yes, this is the start of it. I have a question, though. It's 10 right be 10 before it. Is it smart before I talk to him to go around? You know, like the original spell force, go around and, and killing stuff off. One. Or is all them lock gates is basically re that stops you killing them? You know, because I don't think they're in these locations. So I'm just going to go back before that and check. It's famous for their golden. And we're going to save this as a new one before I talk. So I go game. back just in case the they end up building. The oh, oh shit! I'm trying to talk. Stop talking over me. Shush. What's next? Yeah, this is before we spoke to him. So we're gonna save this. I'm glad I got all this. I got this all saved. I'm glad I had the one right before it. So obviously, you're playing a game like this. Make sure you save often because the devs decide to patch. You can blow your game to smithereens. Um, the top here. Game sixteen. Okay. So before we talk to him, what I was trying to say before the thing get going off and on on me. I want to walk around here, see if there's any of them around. If there isn't, if there is, I want to kill them, but I've got a feeling they're behind them gates. I guess what I've got a feeling. They're all behind gates, basically. What was it, shift? I've got a feeling they're behind gates, I want me to hurt anyone first, but we're going to have to see. <clears throat> so unlock any of this blackness and see if there's any we can fight but I've got a feeling they only come out of them gates once you start the that fight way. and if that's the case you know in here it means I have to be very aggressive when I start because look they're all blocked off so what's the plan I gotta be very aggressive. What I wasn't, I was trying to build up here and if I get a nice thing, then we come out strong and hammer them. Didn't realise these could die at the bottom when I was doing that, unfortunately. Yeah, I did that for. Now I wanna have all the map unlocked and see if there's any I can kill pre pre pre, pre uh, before the battle, but I don't think there is looking at this. Mm -hmm. uh, alright, why not? But I wanna be able to jump in there, build, build quick, get the fences up quick. There's no way of gathering resource before we enter the map, is there? <clears throat> At least having mm -hmm. the shadow disappear gives me a little advantage to scouting beforehand. Because then I want to take the first group and say, as a defense, go straight in and maybe start taking this here. And get these build, build, quick, quick, quick. Uh, and try to get some turrets up, what's more important than anything, to keep them out. And try and keep my group mobile. It's going to be my new plan I believe but it's gonna work it's a different matter. Okay we have Danger a few <clears throat> and this could help with the XP so going this stuff in here could help too. Look at these traps. I knew she's alive and she's getting hammered a little bit by these. You two. Oh, you've done it. I was say, kill them. Yes. More fighting. Yeah, no more fighting. Don't go down. Okay, he's spawning these little things. 
Yeah, oh, she is. She's making the legs. Danger up ahead. Help, please. I'm trying to help. Good. I've got a chance. Please. Fine. Whatever's necessary. You'll have to wait. Here we go. Yeah, we're gone. Lock on this chest appears to be an unusual complex. Only a master thief could open this chest without a key. So, so. But I think that's what I'm going to do because apparently they don't own all this. But the more weight, the sooner they're going to take it. So I need to do a, a map grab, so to speak, as quick as possibly established. Hopefully, to get established in such a way that I can have to get resources up quicker and faster and out protect them, especially Understood. if they were relying on their resources when I was just sitting there from earlier. They're definitely relying on that. I definitely need to do that. More and there's keep you a shouting. group here, stuff like that. <clears throat> See, like these, just, these could be helping kill these and that. You'll have to wait. Kill them now, don't have to deal with them after. Please. Trying. Don't die. Get ready. <clears throat> Come on, you. Please. Please. Oh, down. He killed one of our heroes. Yeah, I can see that. Oh. I think you're living snot over that, shall I? I need help over we'll here, do. sure. Son of a. Uh. Guys, deal with that while I get these back up. Come on. Don't die on us now. Dwarf, hang in there. Oh crap. Wrong place, wrong time. Help. Please. Rest. You got it. Bandits up ahead. All right. That should be okay now. Killed them all good. I think the kid died when he blew up, didn't they? Fair enough. Let's do this. See, so it's like these extra units round. Killing them is going to be XP. And they're not on the map later on. So this is probably what I should have done. Obviously, inspect the patch to make the AI super good, or well, at least in the circumstances that the way I had that particular map on. Like now, the I know how to basically get through that. Hopefully, be more aggressive, take the places quicker. Like the skirmish, like this, I haven't really had to do that with this, so I haven't. That's the way. Sounds like a plan. It's a bad plan. That way? Yeah, this way. We're just trying to unlock all the shells that we can. Basically. See if there's any units we need to kill. Uh, see if there's uh, um, any boxes that we can grab. Before we hand this over and they stop pouring out. Then we need to be quick. Because we need to basically take these and take these and start squeezing them. Instead of just coming one way and then they get killed. Now would you look at that? Whoa. 
Mora dedicated to a fallen hero. The inscription across the stone reads, those who seek enlightenment will grant infinite riches. Nice. This way, right? Oh, nice. Oh, I knew. Oh, privilege of protection. Uh, ten in it. Pages torn, stats for blood and mud. There is one small part that you can read. Group of mages wandering our land. We were able to stay silent. Nothing was needed. Right now. Um. Armor. Fear is a lot better. It's an artifact, but 30 30. Hmm. Purity against all the buffs and purges. Cleanse all allies around you every five seconds. Ooh, that might work well for the um, the dwarf. Oh no, he can't. He can't swap armor, can he? I guess me then. The dwarf can't swap his armor, and she can't use it. So yeah, so basically, I'm getting better uh, defenses for the first four. I'm losing out on fire defense. I'm gaining a bit on frost, and I'm losing the other two, but. Debuff purge, cleanse all our lives, so that might be worth it. Oh yeah, that looks oh that looks cool. It matches my little thingy. Nice. Oh yeah. <laughs> now I'm looking better. <clears throat> oh well, actually we should be ending this episode now. So next episode we'll continue clearing this map, basically. And then the episode after we're probably gonna start this attack. What I'm probably going to do next time I play, what might be a few weeks from now. So even if they do patch, it ain't going to mess with them, is it? Ooh, spiders. Right, the next episode. Bye, everyone.